see the shining in the children. Some of you are just it's so beautiful anyway. But it's a, it's a good thing for us all to be here. So I'm just saying, welcome. Welcome. The joy of Easter is what we're celebrating today. You know, there is a scripture that I'd like to think about from Romans, the sixth chapter, fourth verse. <clears throat> we were therefore buried with him through baptism into death, in order that just as Christ was raised from the dead through the glory of the Father, we too may live a new life. And so we're going to take the opportunity to fellowship, to see our kids, uh, do some amazing work, and celebrate the, the you know, we mourn the death. And now we're celebrating the, the resurrection. And we're starting that with our group today. So I'm going to um, get us started today, and uh, we're going to be followed by a prayer by Miss Henry, and then a congregational song, um, He Lives. And so, Miss Henry, would you join us, please? May we pray. <clears throat> Most high and holy God, we thank you for the miracle and precious gift of today as we rejoice and celebrate the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, our gift of salvation. We ask that you keep us faithful every day. Grant that we receive all of your blessings with gratitude. And may the indwelling of your Holy Spirit cause us to reflect the fruit of the Spirit toward others in our spiritual growth. Give us eyes to see the beauty of each day. We ask that you draw us closer to you, dear Lord, as we rest in believing your promise to never leave us alone, our constant companion. We are so thankful that you care deeply about the intimate details of our lives. As Christians, help us to associate together, to strengthen and encourage one another in our service to you, Heavenly Father, speaking to each other of your love and the truth of redemption. Guide us throughout each day that we may make decisions that honor and glorify your holy name. In Jesus' name we pray. <coughs> Amen. Amen. song, He Lives, the first and second courses.
come and present to us today. And I don't know about y'all, but I'm excited. I'm just so excited. And we're going to start with Miss Sarah Payne. Followed by her brother, Joe. <laughs>
Christ brings hope. Christ brings hope. To every soul. Every soul. Every soul. Every soul. Oh, God. <laughs> Please stand up again. Please stand up. 
had an Easter program. We've seen our kids just doing such mighty things. We are, I'm just so insanely happy. Uh, I don't have any kids at home anymore, and they don't call me no more. <laughs> I'm so glad to see the ones that we have here. And I just want to say thank you so much, young people, for learning these and being brave enough to come up here and do such a fantastic job. And I just want to give another hand. And as always, I get to stand up here, and Alec, I did something part of the whole uh, <coughs> preparation for it, but I just get up here and stand there and take credit for the things that Ms. Wyatt, uh, who really took the lead on this, I want to thank you so much for what you did to pull this program together. Ms. Freeman. <laughs> Ms. Freeman, I know you had, you had a surprise for us all, and uh, you worked very, very hard to put it all together. And again, um, just don't look at me and say, well, oh, this floor is doing so great. This floor didn't do anything. It's, just been up here. It's, a, it's always people down in the background. And certainly, uh, Miss Anna Jo pulling the music together. <laughs> Can't be done without music here. And, and you know, we are celebrating. We had our period of mourning when we were sad that we had to die. But boy, are we glad that the most important day in the Christian calendar has occurred today. He arose from the dead. And so, when we leave from this um, celebration, I'll ask the kids to please go back to the East Annex. Come back to the East Annex, and there you're going to find something that's uh, maybe. That's at the church, sir. Oh, no, no, no. 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 I thought it was a... okay. So, there's a catch. There's a catch. They have to stay. So, you got to stay at the church now. <laughs> Because after church services, uh, we want the children to come to the East Annex and uh, pick up a little, little gift that we have for you there, all right? So again, thank you so much. Great, great celebration we had today. The kids did a fantastic thing, and now we, we can look to the future. Um, I'm going to ask that uh, our pastor come up and uh, give us any words and certainly our closing prayer. Thank you so much, everyone. Good morning to everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Christ has risen. Amen. He's risen indeed. Can you say that? Christ has risen. He's risen indeed. Christ has risen. Christ has risen. He's risen indeed. He's risen indeed. And we celebrate this wonderful Resurrection Sunday. And what a joy it was to see our children sharing with us from the little babies to our senior in high school. Amen. What a blessing. Amen? Amen? What a blessing. All I can say is wow. 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 We praise God for uh, you parents and grandparents and whoever helped uh, these children in preparation for we know that there was some time of memorization <laughs> and, work, and work that took place. And so thank you for contributing that time and giving and sharing. And we were blessed because of your efforts. Amen? Amen. Amen. And I know the children, they were blessed as well. I, I remember as a little child myself going through that moment of the butterflies and stumbling through speeches. But now I'm here speaking. I still stumble at times, you know that. But God gave me confidence even through those small moments. Uh, encouragement for family and friends for that. I'm grateful for that tradition continuing and being a part of it and seeing it and witnessing it on this Lord's Day. Let's have a closing prayer as we prepare uh, to end this time and prepare for worship at 11 o'clock. Let us pray. Thank you, Lord, for Resurrection Sunday, for this Easter in which we gather to celebrate your resurrection because you got it we are able to stand and to live in a new life in you. Thank you for these precious children who shared their messages, their songs. Thank you for what you have placed within them, that the resurrection story will be centered in the circumference of their entire lives from this day forward, that they will be able to live because of the resurrection power that is birthed even in this place, in their homes, through their families, 
allow the hope of Jesus Christ to sustain them their lifelong journey while they walk upon this earth. Thank you for every family that's represented here today. Bless them that they will be able to live according to your power and your strength that they will receive because of the resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And as we worship today, the resurrected Lord, be glorified in our worship. Thank you, Lord, for Jesus Christ, our Lord, our Savior, and our Redeemer. It's in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 God bless.